here at Riley Hospital for Children, we really see a huge variety of patients. I think it's one of the biggest strengths of our program is that we see kids throughout the state of Indiana um, with a variety of infections, um, from very healthy kids with um, unusual infections to um, kids that have been in the hospital a lot with a lot of complex medical issues. So we really get to see a, a wide variety of things. The first year of fellowship is really heavily weighted towards clinical practice. And so they will spend over half the year on clinical service. Fellows do get the opportunity to do their own fellowship clinic um, twice a month, half a day. Um, that is continuous throughout their three years of, pro of training. We collaborate closely with the adult infectious disease specialists at IU and our fellows rotate for one month with that service just to see their perspective. But one of the unique things for fellows in our program is that we have that primary pediatric ID service. And so the fellows are responsible for not only leading the attending on rounds, but also leading a whole team of residents, medical students, and other learners. So it's a really unique opportunity for teaching. During years two and three is much more focused on their research. And so fellows have the opportunity to plan their research during their first year and um, in year two and year three, they really get to carry out their research during that time. And it's much more of a dedicated time that they have to spend on that. We do a variety of different research here in Indiana and it really spans the gamut from um, very basic um, mouse research to very clinically oriented research. And so um, we have researchers that are looking into um, clinical research in staph aureus infections and bone and joint infections in kids, trying to figure out what, what are the best treatments and diagnostics. We also have a great opportunity um, partnering with the Children's Health Research Service as well as some of the informatics that we have here. So there's a variety of different things that we can do locally. So one of the things that makes our program really special is the global health opportunity. So our division is the Division of Pediatric Infectious Disease and Global Health, which is really unique as there aren't very many programs like this across the country. With our Indiana Center for Global Health, we have opportunities for research in diverse fields of study, from gauging and in care or child development to immunology and gut microbiome and HIV, malaria, and TB. Our field sites for infectious disease research um, are primarily uh, within Kenya and Uganda, where we have research teams working on the ground and the infrastructure to help support fellow and trainee research. Because of the clinical flexibility we have within our Pediatric Infectious Disease Fellowship, it allows for opportunities to do longer term projects, even up to six months in international settings. If fellows are interested in even longer term projects, perhaps for a year or more, we also have options for a Fogarty Fellowship that they could apply to. Also locally though, there's a lot of um, really great opportunities that we have to do things, um, both in clinical and translational research. So um, we try to expose our fellows to as much different types of research as possible, and we let them um, really meet with mentors and kind of go down the path that they are interested in. Uh, our fellows do have the opportunity to get on um, to training grants. So right now, currently, we have two fellows that are both on T32 training grants um, that will fund their research for the next two years. On top of the T32, there's a lot of local and international opportunities for funding that are good opportunities for them to do their long-term research. We are a relatively new program, and so I think we have a lot of um, exciting opportunity to grow and expand our program. I would love to see our fellows going out and seeing all the exciting things they can do across the country. When we're looking for candidates for our fellowship, we really want it to fit. We're really looking for people that are excited about pediatric infectious disease, obviously, but more than that, we're looking for people that are wanting to be leaders in academic medicine. Um, we certainly, as I said, we, we try to um, train really strong clinicians and we know that that's a very important part, but we're hopefully looking to grow the next generation of infectious disease doctors. So we're really looking for people that want to take leadership roles and be active members in the pediatric infectious disease community.